I wanted to make a quick video on the version 50 update. So it would be an update to the update. Uh, I jumped back into the headset. Uh, after I did that video, I actually turned off the, you know, the new touch thing uh, function. And then I came back in. Again, you have to go into experimental features, direct touch. And then this happened. So when I first made the video, when I first saw that I had version 50, this wasn't there. This is like a you know little tutorial. It just wasn't there. And then all of a sudden now it is. So I'm thinking maybe they're just actually adding as they do the update. They just continue to add. So I just wanted to show this to you real quick. Let me let me put my controller down. Oh, that was quick. It went straight into hand tracking. Usually it's a hit or miss with that. All right, so now you can still do the pinch thing, but if I turn this way, I can touch. Hand tracking enabled, no kidding. You previously enabled hand tracking, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, you guys can read that if you want. If you use hand tracking, your head estimates your hand size, yeah and collects information about your hand pull. Ooh, and pulls as explained in the hand's privacy. That I didn't realize. So yeah, it's uh, pretty close. Not perfect, but pretty close. Much better than in the beginning when I first got the headset. Come on, see how that, that's cool. <laughs> Continue, use your extended finger. So it's, a, it's just a quick tutorial. It tells you what to do, so. Can do all that now. So up and down. It's not perfect. I will say that it's not exactly tracking me. And I do have uh, a good amount of light in this room. Uh, usually, it's the the fact that it's dark. But... So this one's not bad. Going left to right, it's it's doing okay. But going up and down, yeah, it, it loses it. So right now, for me to still engage with the with this little panel here, not only do I have to touch here, but when it starts to lose, I actually keep pushing. So I'm, now my hand is actually behind this thing. All right. Move your hand away from the panel until you see a line, then point and pinch to select. So this is, I think this is what they had before when it was just this. I could be wrong. Move your hand away from the panel until you see a line, then point and pinch to select. What are you, what are you talking about? This thing, right? Yeah. Okay. Scroll up. Yeah, this is, this is the, this is the original one showing you how to do it this way. So I guess it, they just added the other part where you can actually touch with your finger. Anything else? Facing your palm. Yeah, yeah, this, this, is, this is old stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alrighty. Yeah, okay. So it looks like they also updated the tutorial. The old tutorial by adding that first part and then it just kind of uh, loops together. I know about that one. I've tried that one. Is this new? First hand? I don't think I've seen that before. That might be new. Yeah, let's, let's, come on. See, it doesn't always register. You hear the, the feedback, whoa. Uh, this has, oh, it's an app lab. Okay, that's fine. Let's see, let's lower the volume here because this is gonna bleed out into the microphone, I'm sure. So I don't know if this is new. Oh, okay, it's not that, it's not that new. <laughs> but I just never seen it before, so it's an app lab thing. Maybe I'll do a video on it. Uh, not now though. But again. You haven't paired any controls required to use this app. You still like, yes. Now again, this is, it's not perfect, 
not at all perfect. Um, that's kind of cool though. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if it's because I grabbed it this way. Maybe not. Yeah. But as I said, it's it's close, but not perfect. So it registers, but then it doesn't always hold on to that. Maybe, again, maybe it's just my headset. Maybe the lenses are not picking up as well. But yeah, that's what I wanted to uh, share with you was this new, let's uh, get out of here. Let's see if it'll work first. Come on, you see, it's not, come on. So as I go closer, and touch it. Notice my hand is moving. My hand's not moving. The virtual hand is moving. It's losing sync with my actual hand. I don't know what, what the cause of that is, but it, it's probably better with the controller. So let's pick up the controller and see. So now, let's see, real quick here. Okay. It's a little bit better. The, the, Response time is not great, but it doesn't it doesn't shift around. See, it stays put. It's not moving around like when I just use my hand. There we go. So yeah, that's just uh, something I found this morning. Uh, thought I'd share that as well. And uh, if you like this video, hit the like button. If you want to see more, subscribe. If you haven't already done so. Um, and leave a comment. Let me know what you liked, what you disliked. Let me know what you might want to see later on. Uh, and hopefully I'll be able to do that for you. So, with any luck, I'll see you again in the next one. And until then, take care.